So the last couple days, I've been beating up, beating up my right hand really badly for just a few minutes. I would take off my glove and did that, did that. That one really hurts every time you touch the top of the glove. And then yesterday, I did that wearing my glove. And I guess it probably would help if I cleaned it out. But that thing is stinging so bad. Like, oh. Ugh, I guess that's probably why you should clean out cuts, but I'll live. Man, I'm kind of pissed I'm not in my Chevy. I have about a foot-long knife in my Chevy. I always keep in it. There was a deer just along the road that basically had his leg ripped off and he just got hit by a car. Still alive, but I don't have a gun or a knife in this truck. So, what can I do? Not a lot. Otherwise, I'd have pulled over and slid it through it. I put it out of its misery. But, because I'm in the Ford, I don't really have anything to do with, so. Someone else okay, so that deer was just around the bend up here earlier. Let's see if it's still here. be dead by the time we get there, which is perfectly all right with me. I'm on the road of the about to kill. Sorry, but I did you a favor. It's not alive anymore. Okay, so that definitely wasn't the funnest thing in the world to do. It's a little fawn. Did not take any pleasure in killing it. But the whole back half of it was run over by something and it's paralyzed hadn't moved for an hour it's still alive but hadn't moved so where's he gonna go his whole back half's gone so i shot him twice through the heart and lung ish area one through the spine still took him 15 minutes to die he was around with two arrows to him for 15 minutes I don't know, I'm not the biggest fan of archery after that. I think I'll just stick to rifle season. 